So my second short talk is about an experiment I'm willing to make uh, at uh, CAM++ and also uh, hopefully uh, at uh, other conferences too. Uh, it's called Drunk and Debuggers. And uh, first of all I'd like to uh, summarize the hacker conventions I've been to, I've been to a couple of ones. Uh, so the crowd is basically made of Greeks, freaks and nerds as the outside world sees us. Uh, I would say that uh, there are highly talented, really interesting people with uh, little social uh, skills. Uh, most of the time, of course. Uh, I don't want to generalize everything, of course. Uh, also, uh, there are highly diverse topics, topics like hardware and software, uh, building and breaking, uh, technical, social, cultural, or maybe artistical stuff. Uh, but uh, my my thing was to, to somehow connect, uh, try to connect these people, bring these people together, because I believe that uh, these really interesting, talented people together can uh, do some really cool stuff. So, how do we do that? Uh, first, some observations. Uh, the, the common factor among us, I believe, is that we all into interesting challenges. Is that right? Yeah. 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 Also, uh, many of us like fine drinks. Uh, maybe some of us do not, but uh, the most guys who I've talked to, who I've been drinking with, uh, are really into boobs. <laughs> Sense of bias. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but uh, there's another thing, which, uh, so the, the first uh, two points were of course uh, highly positive, I believe. Uh, the third one is, is some difficulty, because uh, if you go to a guy uh, in a conference and ask him about what he's doing, then he can tell you, he or she can tell you about uh, uh, everything he or she made in the last couple of months, maybe years. You can ask Stefan about how uh, his last uh, project uh, uh, went through those uh, phases and changes and what he did and how he failed and to, to get into his project, his ideas, it takes, uh, it takes forever. But uh, I think uh, all of us have many small projects uh, which were never uh, interesting enough or important enough to uh, spend some time on. Uh, for example, some script that uh, you would take, I don't know, two hours to write, but uh, you can do the same thing manually in half an hour. That's, I think, a typical example that, uh, okay, I do that five or ten times even, but uh, I never spend the two hours to actually automate the thing that uh, would uh, make my life easier. Next time I will, uh, for example, uh, make the script do my job in two seconds instead of one, uh, half an hour. So, I thought, what if uh, we uh, bring all these small ideas that we never had enough time to work on and sew them together? This is the basic thing. So let's collect ideas which can be solved in a couple of hours. Uh, I don't uh, care about uh, saving the world or something. But uh, interesting challenges uh, which are uh, worth solving. Bring them together, uh, solve them together and uh, have some fun. Meet each other and, and talk to each other. Because maybe I have some problem that uh, I could only solve in 10 hours for example, but uh, there's some guy who is really experienced in the topic and uh, he sees that I'm working on that project right now and he can solve it in 10 minutes, for example. So, uh, my plan is to, to gather uh, some people, give a platform in which you can see what projects uh, the participants are Sorry, so uh, what project the participants uh, have uh, put in 
and anyone can choose anything uh, he finds attractive or uh, believes he has experienced in and help each other solve these problems so we can know each other better. Uh, it's a pattern. Uh, I, it should be a pattern. I, I came up with this idea after we, we came back from the last CCC uh, on the train. Uh, I, don't do, uh, I don't know if Stef remembers, uh, because uh, we spent a couple, couple of nights with uh, Rhapsody and uh, I don't know, a couple of other guys were there, uh, solving little problems uh, in one of my bigger projects. And it was the most fun I had uh, at the conference, uh, solving things together. So, but uh, it's, um, it, it came out reversing actually, but you can uh, apply it of course on anything you want. Uh, in this phase where we are right now, uh, this whole idea is just an idea. I wrote some code, but it's unfinished. So our first mini project uh, uh, will be to actually assemble the, the infrastructure that supports uh, this idea. I don't believe that uh, this will uh, take more than, I don't know, four hours. And after we did that, everything will be uh, much convenient and much more uh, efficient. So please join us. Uh, here's the GitHub repo uh, and here's the, the bottle that uh, we should drink while solving interesting challenges. Uh, look for this bottle, I'll be there and I, I can give you uh, interesting challenges for sure. Thanks for watching. Can you tell us about some of the challenges that you have in mind and maybe some that we can work together, for example? Yeah, I, I actually wrote together a couple of ideas of mine to, to have something to start on. Uh, I, I made different categories. Uh, there are very simple uh, exercises like uh, how do you convert uh, hexadecimal hashes uh, to Unix script format and vice versa. I tried to do that, uh, do that and it works 90% of the time, but there are edge cases. Uh, and uh, if you can uh, tell me uh, wh what the problem is and how to fix those edge cases, that's great. There are more complex exercises, for example, you probably all heard of, about uh, the heartbeat vulnerability. And there are many enterprise software uh, that is affected. And uh, I try to exploit those uh, uh, the heartbeat vulnerability uh, in case of those software, but uh, I didn't succeed. I'm sure it is possible to extract some information, but uh, I. I will need some more testing, some more ideas that uh, I, I uh, believe that you can uh, give me. And also I believe that I can give you some more uh, ideas and, and uh, more uh, solutions for your problems too. Hey. <laughs> Any more questions? Also, of course, there are uh, some challenges to, for example, set up a website where all these projects will be listed and everyone can uh, send in some projects and download descriptions and everything. So, um, I have not quite a question, but we, I have seen you list and one of the items was a rock chain on hardware architectures. <coughs> um, and since I'm doing this ARM32 workshop, which is a lot of hardware architecture, I think tomorrow at the workshop, we can have, we can, if you have, if you have some ARM32 device or something that can be attached to a JTAG, uh, JTAG debugger, uh, and it's a hardware architecture, we, we, we can have a look and try to do a rock chain on that. Yeah, uh, that, that I'm really excited sense. about this. Actually, this might be a part of the workshop, of both of the workshops tomorrow. Yeah. So it's all day, every day, find it at any time, and, and do some cool stuff. Thank you.